Well, new at 530 now, Erie County legislators have reached a deal to equip dozens of sheriff's deputies with body cameras. The compromise coming after weeks of contention over money to pay for the body cams. Channel 2's Jeff Preval sifts through the politics here as we continue to hold people in power accountable. The deal reached by Erie County legislators means about 100 sheriff's deputies on road patrol could be wearing body cameras this fall at the earliest, but it has taken weeks to get here. In May, legislators voted unanimously to approve $600,000 for body cameras. The money, though, has sat within the Division of Information and Support Services, so the county's chief information officer can work with the sheriff's office. But this caused concerns over the chain of custody of video evidence and questions over who would actually have control of the data. We're not going to risk convictions uh, of bad people because we stored the data in the wrong place. So the sheriff's office wanted the funds transferred to them. Democrats on the ledge refused and said the money would only be transferred if the sheriff's office revealed estimates of how much the body camera program would cost. Was it a matter of trust? It was a matter of trust for me, and I was very clear about that yesterday in the Public Safety Committee. Um, like I said previously, the sheriff made it clear twice in, in the committee that uh, he was not interested in spending additional funding on body cameras, but on a helicopter. The deal reached by Democrats and Republicans falls in line with what Democrats wanted all along. The sheriff's office says today it began looking at applications from companies that would provide the body cameras, and a company will be selected by the end of August. After that, legislators say the money for the body cameras will be transferred to the sheriff's office. It looks like the sheriff's office is going along with what Democrats want. The sheriff's office agreed, fine, this is a priority of us just as much as it is of you guys. We are willing to work with the administration and move forward so that this project can get off the ground. And legislators will be on recess next month. When they come back in September, a decision on which company to go with on the body cameras should be selected, and lawmakers will have to go through the approval process, a long, windy road to increase transparency, and this whole thing isn't over yet. I'm Jeff Perrault, Channel 2 News.